Marvel's Modoc just dropped on Hulu all 10 episodes of the first season. And that dropped on Friday. And, you know, I was going to have this review out yesterday. Oh. Uh, because I couldn't do it Friday. Because I was busy dog singing. And, um. But I sat down to watch it yesterday. And I only could get through just a few episodes. This show is. Some. Was a show I was very excited about. Because I love stop motion animation, so I thought the animation in the show, you know, was just just straight out, it's gorgeous. I love the animation in the show. So it's done by the people who do like robot chicken and stuff, and they that stuff is fun and gorgeous. But I was really excited about it for that reason. I liked the character Modok in the comics, and it looked like a fun, funny show. So you know, I, I was excited to check this one out, and I I. I didn't like it as much as I thought it was. I, I could see a, there's there, there's going to be two crowds with this show. There's going to be people who really hate it or really love it. Because this show has a lot of good things going for it. Like, no one, it's a weird kind of family drama comedy with Modoc, which is hilarious idea and it looks like a lot of fun so there are a lot of people going to watch that and be like yeah that was a lot of fun I love it and then there's the other group of people are going to be like yeah that wasn't that funny and I think a lot of that boils down to the family drama and the um you know superhero super villainy stuff with Modoc's workplace and all that that stuff cuts back in between that stuff constantly it's a constant like Whoop, we're here. Whoop, we're there. Whoop, 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 whoop. And it's like, stop. <sighs> like, it, I, I think these episodes needed better pacing. I think that's why, I think that's why a lot of the humor here didn't work for me. Is a little, It just kept cutting back in between um, those two situations so often that I couldn't even focus on one and get into the humor of one. It just kept cutting back and forth, back and forth. And I think it needed, like, better pacing and it could have really worked. I think this is something that if there were a season two to this show, it could be a lot better. But the show is such a mix, mixed bag. I'm not really sure it's going to get a season two because I think there's going to be... Because I think maybe a lot of people might watch this season. But if, if I don't think many more will come back for season two though. I think it's just such a weird, wacky show that has a lot of issues with it. And I, I enjoyed myself watching it. I got into some of the humor, but I just think that with a season two, the show can be wildly improved upon, honestly. But for the season we got, it was just kind of like some of the humor worked, some of it didn't. And the animation was gorgeous, but I needed I need better pacing so I can dive into these stories of these episodes more and have fun with it. But I just, I didn't get into it. 